Hey everyone, welcome to FD Real M. Our topic this week is trans people in the media, and I'm just going to talk a bit about why it's good that we have trans people in the media. Um, obviously it's good for any community to have representation, especially in the mainstream media and in the news, because it helps for people who are not experiencing those same things to see what goes on and learn a bit about like people's stories. Um, but also be it benefits trans people because it means that we can feel represented and we can be like, oh, this person is also trans and is successful and is teaching people about us and maybe we'll be more accepted in the future. So this is <laughs> going to just be a really short video because I just think that although not all representation is good um, and there's still a lot of ignorance and people in the comment sections like starting fights and being like, trans people aren't real, but the more we are portrayed and the more that other people can see us and be like, wow, trans people are people too, they actually exist, I actually understand a bit about where they're coming from now maybe, um, just helps and helps to reduce ignorance and encourage people to learn about what they're talking about before they start like talking about it. Um, and I think that increased media representation will lead to more of this in the future and I really hope that it does um, especially re with like huge names like Laverne Cox and Janet Mock and um, Aidan Dowling getting so far in the men's health magazine but also with people like Ruby Rose and Miley Cyrus who have come out openly as genderqueer to these whole like sections of fans of things and it's helped them to see that genderqueer people also exist and trans experience isn't necessarily a binary and that gender isn't necessarily isn't a binary um, and that can also help people to understand more about the trans experience because they're learning about it in different ways and they know that there's not just one way to be trans and again that's beneficial for actual trans people to see oh I can also I don't have to be like a binary trans person I can experience my gender in my own way and express it in my own way and that's valid and hopefully because of these other famous people who people are seeing all the time other people will realize that it's valid and my identity is okay so yeah basically I think that trans representation is bad um, at the moment it's getting better and the better it gets the better it will be for everyone because people will understand more about the experiences of trans people and will be more educated and hopefully more accepting and then everything will just be better for everyone. That's all, sorry it was a really short video. I'll catch you guys next week, bye.